Hi everyone, Martin Hazy, Lord Mayor for the City of Adelaide, and I'm here with Councillor Priscilla Corbell and Councillor David Slama. Day three of the Shandong Trade Delegation, and I'm very happy to report we've had an extremely productive day. We started early this morning where we hosted a breakfast for 30 City of Adelaide businesses, and we're here to help these businesses uncover opportunities for them and their business and their employees, their families and our city. And uh, some many great outcomes from this morning's breakfast. We followed this with a trade fair whereby each of these businesses were displaying their products and their services to buyers here in China. So our job today was to support these many businesses and talk and make introductions and basically connect the buyers with the sellers so that ultimately in time transactions can occur. And there were some great successes there too. Also after that, the Premier of South Australia, Jay Weatherall, launched a great new initiative which is called SASD Connect. And you can Google that and you'll find the website. But effectively, it is a portal for South Australian businesses to match what they do with businesses up here in Shandong Province, Jinan City and Qing, Qing, Qingdao City and others. It's a great initiative of which a lot of our businesses are getting on board. So it's been a busy day and Councillor Priscilla Corbell's had a busy day too, who's working on a great initiative. Um, yes, Lord Mayor, it's been a wonderful day. There's been a lot of highlights. Um, supporting the city businesses has been a major one for me, but also um, today we had the announcement of two new amazing ambassadors for Study Adelaide. One this year for um, Qingdao and one for Jinan. So Lucy from, Shun, um, from Shandong University will be coming in July and so will Andy from a, um, a technical college in Qingdao. Now what this means for the city of Adelaide and for South Australia is fantastic exposure for education and for international students to be coming to our state and to be coming to our city. Um, so that was a real highlight for me. Mm -hmm. Councillor Slama, you've also had a busy day. Uh, news to share. We've got some update, Lord Mayor, update on the activity of the, the beer festival. In fact, this afternoon, we met uh, councillors, two councillors, in fact, from York Peninsula, South Australia, and the Mayor of the York Peninsula, as well as the CEO. So four members of that council, we got together, we had um, a lengthy talk about the beer festival, and what was interesting, Lord Mayor, was that the barley, of course, has grown in the, in the York Peninsula. 80% of South Australia's barley is grown on the York Peninsula. A lot of that, of course, exported to the Tsingdao beer and made, made is, is used to make the beer in the Tsingdao beer factory. So that was interesting because, of course, we're working with a beer festival. And so we got together and worked out how, how we can all get involved together with local government to make this beer festival initiative a truly state and local government initiative. And I understand there are some 14 mayors up here in the Shandong province and many more councillors and several CEOs. So there's a great deal of opportunity for the City of Adelaide and there's a great deal of opportunity for South Australia. So thanks everyone and we look forward to seeing you tomorrow.